Okay, what's up guys, Dragonblaze here. Today we have the first episode of the Pokemon Series Dungeon Blue Rescue Team Nuzlocke. So, I'm really happy to do this finally because this playthrough, or this Nuzlocke, I should better say. This Nuzlocke has been something that I wanted to do for so long and I can finally do it. And I can finally show you guys a Mystery Dungeon Nuzlocke again because that's my thing. I am Mr. Mystery Dungeon Nuzlocke, I guess, because I'm pretty much the only one that actually does these things. Or plays, or someone that plays Mystery Dungeon in general. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys are really hyped about this and if you are then you know what to do and um i'm going to start a new game but first before that i want to say um already which pokemon i want to be um i want to become a pikachu and why because pikachu is a pokemon that i've not really seen in any mystery dungeon playthrough or nuzlocke or anything among those lines um before on youtube i've never i've also never heard my friends playing as um pikachu before i've also never heard them talking about it so i want to become a pikachu and if i cannot become a pikachu then i will try and um answer all the questions that I'm about to get um, for um, for Meowth because I really want to become a Meowth or 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 a Cubone one of those three because those three are actually Pokemon that you can't really get um, in the next games other than Pikachu but you can't really become a Meowth or a, a Cubone um, you can also like the other Pokemon that you really can become is uh, Machop because but I really don't want to be a Machop Machop is just lame um, I just want to become a Cubone or a um, Meowth but uh, priority is gonna be Pikachu so I think I said everything here, let's start a new game. Okay. Welcome. This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. Ooh, wow, it's wow, it's so black. Please, do something about it. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Of course, I was born ready, motherfucker. Okay, let's it, let the interview begin. You come across a treasure chest. What do you do? Um, okay, I'm going to pause the um pause the episodes like multiple times here because if I do not know what answer I really want to choose, I'm just going to choose whatever um the list that I have um be behind this screen right now. Um, <laughs> I'm going to choose whatever makes me a um a impish nature or a um, what's it called? Impish nature or a quirky nature, I think, or lonely nature. And um, no, this is not cheating. Just, just this is just basically trying to become the Pokemon that I can, that I can try and become because there's already like a limited amount of questions, and there's not even guaranteed that you will become the Pokemon that you want to be. So it doesn't really matter. So I'm going to um, skip real quick or um, pause real quick. I mean, because I have no idea what to answer to this. Okay, so um, apparently there is actually no, um, there is no question here that can be answered to become a um, Pokemon that I want to be. So I just click on open right away. Have you ever made a pitfall trap? This is a funny one. I never have, but um, I'm going to see what's up with this question. Hey, LMAO. Okay, so um, for this question, if we choose yes, then we actually become a... Um, what's got a impish nature, so that's great. A human head extends out of a toilet. What would you do? Scream and run, close the lid without a word, shake hands with it. I already know this um, question's answer, and I would shake that motherfucking hand. Oh, yes, I would make friends with that toilet hand. Oh, yeah, of course. Like, of course. Like, that, that toilet hand would be, the, that would be my BFF. It would be the one that I would get the booty calls or the handjob calls for. Um, there is a person you like, but there's no opportunity to get close. What do you do? Um, I I have no idea. That's why I'm going to ask the uh, the question list. Okay, so um, pull a prank to get attention is impish. So I'm gonna click on that. Does an alien invasion? What will you do? Oh my lord, <laughs> this is a good one. Um, fight, run, ignore it. I would actually run because hello, motherfucking alien invasion. I have to get my last fab of my life off before I get annihilated. But um, I need to see what kind of question, um, what kind of answer I get for this. Okay, so also nothing that I want to be benefits from um, one of these questions. So I'm just gonna click on ignore it because who the fuck cares about a fucking alien invasion? Let them just take the whole entire planet. Who cares? Um, you broke a run egg in your room. What will you do? Open a window right away. Take a sniffer. <laughs> to be fair, I would I would have done this one to be truly honest. But um, okay, let's see what I can get for this question. Okay, so um, because there is also nothing that actually is benefiting from what I want to become, I'm just gonna be honest here. Take a sniff. Um, the test is coming. How do you study for? Wow. Okay. The nice that you say that in my exam week. Uh, study hard at the last second. Ignore it and play. Um, you know. Um, yeah. I would. I am pretty much doing it right now. Ignore it and play. 
Your country's leader is in front of you. How do you speak to him or her? Speak calmly, speak nervously, whatever! Okay then, um, let's see what's up with this question. Okay, um, I guess speak nervously, because why the fuck not? Are you a boy or a girl? I am a boy, you appear to be... Give me impish! Yes! Okay, so that is, um, that's Pikachu. We are Pikachu, you... Oh, okay, you're playful, cheerful, and love pranks. You're also kind-hearted. Ah, okay, okay, uh, they're, they're already, they're already going the right way. Um, that's why the people around you find you so irresistible. Oh my god, okay, they know everything about me. You must be the most popular person around. Oh, you're not that popular. Um, you're either being modest or you just don't notice it. Oh, oh, oh well. Okay then. Okay, I have some, I have some hidden fame. I, I see how it is. I bet people are just too shy to let their feelings be known. Oh well, that, that's just what some people have. They kind of just show their feelings. Um, there's someone out there who's afraid to declare their love for you. An impish person like you should be the Pokemon Pikachu. Oh yeah, baby. There we go. There we fucking go. Okay, so um, we can actually become a Pikachu now. That's great. So here we also have the Pokemon that we can choose as our partner, and I already know who I want to choose as my partner and it's gonna be it's gonna be Mudskip I like no it's gonna be Trico uh, because I really really like Trico and the second thing I can go Trico one after one of my friends after one of my friends okay Rick pop there we go okay we're all set let's get you into the world of Pokemon go for it like, is this like Arceus talking to us like in 4th gen while we don't even know who Arceus is or something? Or is this like Kamisama? Someone else? Maybe, maybe Arceus is trainer? I don't know. Where am I? Oh yeah, by the way, I like uh, voice acting, so I'm going to voice act the- uh, I'm going to narrate over the whole entire game. Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. Excuse me. Please, wake up. Come on, wake up. Oh, wow. Okay, here we are just, like, in tiny woods, apparently. Uh, you're finally awake. Great. Wh where is this? Huh? Where? You're bust out here. I'm glad to see you awake. I'm Rickbot. Glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around before. Um, I am actually a human, if you didn't know. Huh? You're a human? But you look like a normal Pikachu in every way. What are you talking about? Wait, wait. <gasps> no! No! Oh my god, I... It, it's true! I've turned into a Pikachu. But, but why? I don't remember anything. The, the last time I was with Nicki Minaj and... Uh, but, uh... Um, you're kind of weird. Uh, your name? What's your name? Oh, oh, my name. Oh, that, that's right. I, I still know my name. My name is Andrew. That is what we always call ourselves in the Nuzlocke or playthroughs of Mystery Dungeon. Oh, yes. Oh, Andrew's your name. Well, <laughs> it's a funny name. Oh, okay then. Alrighty then. Well, like, there, there is some that... Wait, um... Somebody, please help me! Oh, I hear shouts from over there. We are, well, let's see if we didn't hear those. Um, oh wow, it's a butterfree. What's up, Hardy? What's up? Well, what's wrong? It's horrible. My caterpie fell into the cavern. Oh, my poor baby. My baby. Oh, what? A, a huge fish over in the ground. My caterpie fell in. He's too young to crawl out by himself. But I want to get my baby. Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Oh, w wait. They attacked you? Huh? You were attacked? By all the Pokemon? They must be enraged by the fish. Not of control. That's what I think at least. Like, I don't know. I'm just a butterfree. From, like, what, what would I know? Um, I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? Oh, what am I to do? Oh there, oh there. Why is she here actually? Like, complaining and like... <laughs> like worrying like shouldn't shouldn't you like go to some place or something this sounds bad we have to go help wait wait but i don't want to i i don't even know where i am oh. okay 
Well then, I, I guess we apparently are here to um, help out. Ah, oh, I did not even... Oh, wow. I did not even choose this. Like, where is my... Like, where's my opinion in this uh, in this world? Come on. Um, but let's put the windows as um, green. Because green is nice. Okay, there we go. Well, okay, nice, nice. That's looking nice. Um, others... How about the upper screen, though? Um, display mode? No, wait. Display mode C, B, um... Let's see, what's up with this? What's... Oh, yeah, here. This is something that I want to um, change up. It was from slow to fast. So, actually, now we are going to um, walk a little bit faster. Um, far off, pals. Um, what the fuck? Um, self, I guess. Um, and then damage, the blah, blah, blah. Um, yeah, that's cool. Wait. Um, what? Did, did I just... Well, okay. Um... I guess it's all done. Yes. Okay, we're done. So here we are in a dungeon. Finally, um, not really finally. Well, uh, I, sh I guess I should say finally because this has been. Um, oh wow. <laughs> okay, we're already at the um, at the entrance. Not bad. Um, but. It has been for so long that we've actually played a Misery Dungeon game, and I'm really, really happy that we're playing a Misery Dungeon game again. So, um, I don't know if I already asked this question before to you guys. Um, we're actually level 6 and we got Tail Whip. That it is actually useful, but what does it matter? Um, I'm going to ask you guys, what is you guys' favorite, um, Mystery Dungeon game because for me it is still gonna be Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky um, Because Explorers of Sky is just amazing and it's great and I think I think it's kind of obvious uh, that I like Explorers of Sky because I even wanted to do the after game until like I got a new computer and like the whole save file um, I lost the whole save file and crap but that's all and we're ready in Tiny Woods wow look at Tiny over there Whoa. Bobby, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to imitate your voice, right here. Um, we came to rescue you. Huh? Your mom's waiting. Let's get out. Okay. <laughs> oh my God, look at Gary there. My baby safe. Oh, honey, never go off, okay? I'm sorry. Um, I don't know how I could have it sent you properly. Oh, that's okay. It has been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fishes like that one. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, may I have your names? At least, I want to know your names. I want, to, I want to be your fans. I'm Rick Pop. In this Andrew, hey, hello. Can I maybe introduce myself? Very cool, Sugoi. Uh, he's uh staring at me, adoringly. Those sparkly eyes. He looks like an anime character. It's a little embarrassing, but it doesn't feel bad either. It's like I'm being a hero. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience or some, or some shit like that, I don't know. Thank you, Rick Bob and Andrew. I know it isn't really enough, but this is a token of our thanks. Please accept it. And we got an Orenberry. Nice. Um, we got a Petroberry. Nice. And we got a Raspberry. Nice. Triple noise. Thank you so much. Goodbye. You get nothing from us. Okay, later. Hey, do, don't we even get any money. I, we actually got your money-making Caterpie that makes the uh, videos all around the place. Come on. Jesus. Oh, wow. People or slash Pokemon these days just don't really have enough gratitude. Thank you for helping. You're very tough. I was sure impressed. So, um, what are you going to do now? Do you have any plans? Well, I plan on going back to where I actually belong and like go back and chill with Nikki, but... Listen, Andrew, if you don't have a place to stay, you, you, you should come with me, you know? Uh, uh, what? <gasps> no! It's already... No! Oh. Wait, wow, that that's a... Wow, okay, never mind. I, I thought it was getting... It was gonna get a little bit sexy time up in here, but apparently not. Well, this is the place. What place? Oh, well, okay. Well then, that house looks like a chestnut. Hmm. I don't know. Um, may maybe, uh, like, Rig, you you like, you like make GFX. You make good designs. Come on. You can make better stuff like that. Come on. Wow. I can't explain, but I'm happy. It looks so scrubbish. I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel weirdly happy. Well, okay, I have to admit that I do like this game. I might be, it might be an instinct. A thing for being a Pokemon. Maybe this is what it feels like to want to wag your tail. Well, I do have a tail. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm a Pikachu. 
Oh, Andrew, you're impressed, aren't you? I'm kind of like, okay, you know what? We could have a little bit more yellow up in here because I'm like a Pikachu, I'm yellow. And maybe also a little bit of green because you're like a Trico. And then it would like say that it was like our little house, you know? Like, you said that this was your house, so we should like live together or some shit like that. So we could also have some places um, five minutes later. And yeah, you know, like maybe... Maybe a TV there and that's done, but yeah, that's my opinion. Um, yeah, but I'm, yeah, I'm kind of impressed. I thought so. Um, I thought this would make a good place for you to live, Andrew. Um, I was sure you would like it. Wow, he's so happy about it. Why do you even offer me a home while we know each other for about 15 minutes? Um, this is your mailbox. They deliver milk from Pokemon here. You know, just like the Fisher Cat we fell into, um, for some reason they have, um, there have been many natural disasters lately. Because of those disasters, many Pokemon are suffering. I want to help Pokemon in these tough times. I want to help, um, I want to help change things so all the Pokemon can live in peace. Why? Do, do you have some special background to that or some shit? Like, did you lose your mom in a vision or something? So, um, well, I, I liked how you handled yourself when we rescued Caterpie. Um, would you like to join me on our rescue team? Andrew, with you, I think we could even become the world's best rescue team. How about it? Wow, you already offered me something like that. You haven't even taken me out on a date yet, and you already want to uh, make a team with me? You know what? Whatever. Form a rescue team. Perfect. That's it then. We're partners in our rescue team from now on. Oh, wow. We're partners. Andrew, glad to have you on board. The team name. Um, well, I don't have one yet. So, Andrew, what do you think would be, what would be a good team name for us? It is gonna be the team name that I had earlier um, in my Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky Nuzlocke. And it's gonna be, wait a minute, Team, no, not just Blaze, it's gonna be Team D Blaze. Because D Blaze is, like, it's one of my nicknames and it's also the nickname that I give to my Lodios. So, I don't know, I, li I like D Blaze for a team name, so there we go. <laughs> Ah, the clean, oh, the cleanest team, team blaze, team base name of my life. Okay, there we go. And to be fair, team, D blaze, D blaze, team base, like you can see in the upper screen, it, it, it draws off the tongue, so I love it. D blaze, I like it, it's a good name, it's perfect for us. Rescue team, D blaze, let's do good starting tomorrow. Uh, starting tomorrow. Hey, LMAO. Okay, so. And that is how Andrew and Rickpa began their careers together as a rescue team. Ah, Pokemon Mr. Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. And here the Nuzlocke starts, people! Yeah, here we go! Nice and Nuzlocke. Here the Nuzlocke actually starts the next morning. Okay, so here I am, just the uh, lazy mofo that I am, and wow, okay. I'm still the same. The way I look. Oh my god, I'm actually talking! Whoa! I just noticed. Because if you guys don't know, in Mystery Dungeon Games, you almost don't talk. You almost never talk. Legit, like, you'd never actually have dialogue. Wow. I'm still Pikachu. Hmm. But why would I be transformed into a Pikachu? Huh. Hmm. Nikki! <sighs> I don't understand that this at all. Uh, I feel groggy and sleepy. Not feeling well. I need more sleep. Let's go back. Okay, there we go. And this is pretty much what you have to do. Like, th this is actually something that they implemented into the game that you specifically have to do. You cannot go outside. So, uh, this pretty much shows that this is your um, save point. So, yeah. <sighs> this same fucking shit again. <sighs> I'm still a Pokemon, not a human. But I feel refreshed. I still look like a Pokemon, but... Ah, oh, that's right. Oh, that Pokemon! I think it was Rickpop? Was it that that one dude? Um, We made a promise to form a rescue team together. I wonder what Rickpop is doing. I should go out. But you know what, guys? I'm going out tomorrow. Uh, first, let's really... Uh, let's uh, say really quick. And there we go. Um, This was the first episode of the Pokemon Mystery Dungeon... Blue Rescue Team. I was about to say Express of Sky there. This is the first episode of the Pokemon Blue Rescue Team. Now, so, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this. And um, yeah, I will see you guys in episode two. I really, really like recording this actually. Even though this like episode one, I'm probably gonna bulk record that crap out of this game. Um, but the question of the day um, will be next to me here, or well, next to me. It's not really face cam. I actually wanted to make this face cam almost, but I was like, there's no 
really no space for it anymore so oh well uh, maybe I can implement it later on and just like remove the logo or some shit but that is just uh, that's for another day for another night but um yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed and uh, yeah answer the question of the day I would really like that I would really like to know what uh, you guys favorite um, Mr. Dungeon game is because I'm all about that Express of Sky life so yeah I uh, hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you guys later bye bye